Hey, today we're going to talk about how Jesus fed like 4,000 people. Uh, there's another instance where he fed 5,000, um, and, and those are both huge numbers, pretty miraculous, pretty incredible where God's providing, uh, and it reminds us that he can provide. And uh, here, here was the situation, there's this great crowd, and um, they didn't have anything to eat, so uh, Jesus is like, What's, what, we're, we're going to feed them, you're going to feed them. And, uh, and the disciples are like, how do we do that, man? We're, there's nowhere to buy food, and, and how are we going to do that? And he says, well, what do you got? You got any food? How many loaves? And they have seven loaves, and he has everybody sit down. And he takes the seven loaves, and he gives thanks. He gave them to the disciples to set before the people, and they set it before the crowd. And they had a, a few small fish, and he blessed them. And, and, and he said that these also should be set before them. And they ate and were satisfied and they took up the broken pieces, seven baskets full. And it says there were about 4,000 people, and he sent them away. That's in Mark 8, um, verses like 1 to 9. Uh, pretty incredible story reminding us that God can do anything, right? That, that, that he can take just a little bit because he made everything out of nothing. And so... Him taking some some loaves and some fish, like he can he can he can feed, you know, twenty thousand. He could you know what I mean. There, there, there's no limit to what he can do, and he wants us to remember that when we feel up against it, when we feel like we have no hope, we don't feel like we can do this, and we're like losing like uh, you know losing everything. Like what are we gonna do? He's got this. Look at this passage. Remember. This is real. Remember this happened. Remember, this is the same Jesus who went and died, who went and rose. Uh, it will not hold back. It will give us what we need. You just got to ask. We just got to say, Lord, this is what's going on. This is what I need. And I want to be honest with you. I want to give you my need. I want to just lay it all out there. Because he's ready to listen. He's ready to bless. And he's ready to provide for us and to help us. It's what he does each and every day. So we can trust him. So let's do that. And let's encourage each other to trust him as well. I'm Pastor Fred. This is the follow through. Hit that subscribe button, share this with somebody. and We'll talk to you next time.